Welcome back to another Madden NFL 25 video in which today we have an NFC North divisional matchup between the Green Bay Packers and the Detroit Lions. Let me know in the comments below who do you guys think will win this game in real life and what do you guys think the score will be. If you like this type of content, like and subscribe. It really helps the channel out and I appreciate all the support as we are trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. So without further ado, let's get straight into this one and see which team will come out on top. Let's get it. Jordan Love and the Packers offense will get the ball to start off the game. So let's go take a look at his stats from last year as he had 372 out of 579 attempts, 4159 yards, 32 touchdowns to 11 interceptions. Here on 2nd and 3, Jordan Love is under center and has a play action pass as he throws it over the middle. The pass is caught and completed to number 9, Christian Watson, who flips the field and takes it all the way up to the Lions 28 yard line. And let's take a look at the replay right there as Love was well protected and throws a little bit of a behind pass. But Watson does a great job to come up with a catch and avoid the defender's hit on the play. Here on 1st and 10, Jordan Love is well protected as he checks it down and fires it over the middle of the pass is caught and completed to Josh Jacobs who gets the first down in the red zone at the 17 yard line. Here on 1st and 10, Jordan Love is well protected as he checks it down. He throws it straight into the hands of the defender as he is picked off by number 34, Alex Anzalone, on the play as he rolls into the end zone and poses to celebrate with his teammates. And let's take a look at the replay right there as Jordan Love just tried to force the ball in and Anzalone does a great job to move his hands and to come up with the pick as Jared Goff will take to the field for the first time today with the offense. Let's take a look at his stats from last year as he had 407 out of 605 attempts, 45, 75 yards, 30 touchdowns to 12 interceptions. Here on third and three, Jared Goff quickly fires it over the middle as the pass is caught and completed to his running back number 26 on the play as they get the first down at the 28 yard line. That was Gibbs with the catch. Here on 1st and 10, Jared Goff quickly fires it over the middle as the pass is caught and completed for the first down to Amon Ross St. Brown at the 42 yard line. And let's take a look at the replay right here to see how the play unfolded as Jared Goff instantly sees the open space and allows his receiver to gain extra yardage after the catch. Here on 2nd and 4, Jared Goff hands it off to Jameer Gibbs who gets the first down and takes it up to the Packers 42 yard line. Here on 3rd and 3, Jared Goff steps out of the pocket and tries to fire it but the pass is incomplete as Amon Ross St. Brown drops the pass. It'll be 4th and 3 at the Packers 35 yard line for the Lions. The Lions send out their field goal unit as the kick is up and it is good. The Lions will take a 3-0 lead over the Packers here in the second quarter. Here on third and four, Jordan Love is well protected as he takes a shot deep. He has a wide open receiver and Christian Watson who takes it to the house and the Packers take the lead right back as they lead 7-3 here in the second quarter and it was only a matter of a few plays for the Packers to take the lead just like that as that was a great route by Watson and a great throw by Love to get that touchdown. Here on 2nd and 10, Jared Goff is well protected in the pocket as he completes the pass over the middle to his tight end Sam Laporta who gets the first down at the 49 yard line as we hit the 2 minute warning. Here on 2nd and 3, Jared Goff has time in the pocket as he completes the pass over the middle to Sam Laporta who will take it to the one yard line just inside the one. I thought that was going to be a touchdown, but the defender just gets his shoelace to stop him before the end zone. It'll be first and goal for the Lions with just under two minutes to go here in the first half. Here on first and goal, Jared Goff hands it off to David Montgomery who takes it to the house as the Lions now lead the Packers 10-7 with about a minute 30 left here in the first half as he dances to celebrate. Let's take a look at the replay right there as it was well blocked and opened up the lane to get into the end zone. 
the Lions get the ball to start off the second half. And here on second and 10, Jared Goff has lots of time as he completes the crosser to his tight end, Sam Laporta, who gets a great block and takes it to the house. And just like that, the Lions increase their lead to 17-7 to over the Packers to start off the second half. And let's take a look at the replay right there as Jared Goff had a nice pocket and completes a dot to Sam Laporta who breaks the tackle and gets a good block on the edge from number 26 who gets him into the end zone. Here on third and 10, Jordan Love has lots of time in the pocket as he checks it down. It'll be just short on the line again. It'll be fourth and two at the 39 yard line as it'll be a three and out for the Packers. It is now third and inches for the Lions at their 31 yard line and Goff takes a shot but just misses his throw as he had a wide open David Montgomery down the field. And that's a pass that Jared Goff will love to have a redo on. Here on 2nd and 7, Jordan Love quickly fires it over the middle as the pass is caught and completed for a first down at the 35-yard line. Here on 3rd and 1, Jordan Love has time in the pocket as he quickly fires it over the middle. The pass is caught and completed to number 89, Sims, as they flip the field and take it into field goal range at the Lions' 31-yard line. And Jordan Love had a option play right there as he throws it right down the seam for the first down. Here on third and five, Jordan Love hands it off to Josh Jacobs who breaks the tackle and finds space on the right hand side as he will take it to the house. And the Packers make it interesting as the Lions lead 17 to 14 here in the fourth quarter. It is only a three point game as he gets great blocks on the edge and has open room to take it to the house. Here on third and two, Jared Goff hands it off to the running back, but he is met in the backfield as number seven gets the stop on Montgomery, and it'll be a three and out for the Lions here in the fourth quarter. Here on third and five, Jordan Love is well protected as he fires it over the middle. The pass is caught and completed to Romeo Dobbs for the first down at the 47-yard line. Here on 2nd and 10, Jordan Love steps back in the pocket and fires it towards the right side of the field as he is picked off on the play. And the Lions will take over at the 47-yard line as that was Brian Branch that comes up with a pick as he celebrates with his teammates in the end zone. Let's take a look at the replay right here to see how the play happened. And Jordan Love tried to fit the ball to his receiver but Branch does a great job to come downfield and come after the ball and with one first down the Lions can seal their win right here. Here on first and 10 Jared Goff hands it off to Gibbs who takes it upfield and gets the first down at the 38 yard line as the Packers will use their first time out of the half. Here on 1st and 10, Goff is under center and gets a great block as Montgomery finds lots of space down the right side of the field as he takes it into the red zone down at the 15-yard line. Jared Goff will now lead his team into victory formation as the clock will run down to triple zeros as the Detroit Lions are going to defeat the Green Bay Packers 17-14. Let me know in the comments below. Who do you guys think will win this game in real life? And what do you guys think the score will be? If you like this type of content, like and subscribe. It really helps the channel out. And I appreciate all the support as we are trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. If you're a fan of the NFL and college football, stay tuned as we'll be covering both all season long. Appreciate all the support and we'll catch you in the next one. Take care.